Paralogue, Master of the Arcane Arts. Um, this secluded region is somehow ominous. Is your daughter really in a place like this? Yeah, this should be it. It wasn't like this when I came before, but... No way is something there. Siala? How worrisome, let's hurry ahead. Yeah. Faceless? That's a lot of faceless. Wow, how did it become like this? It's full of faceless. The source of them seems to be that house. What? That's Siala's house. That girl, she's done it this time. Huh? Done it this time? What do you mean? Siala likes forbidden spells. Recently, she's shown interest in the art of summoning. So that means no way. I've finally done it. This is the growth stick magic Nor uses. There's no doubt in my mind. Siala summoned those faceless. Wow, she's able to do something like that? She certainly is your daughter, a frightful magical genius. Is this really the time for admiration? My own daughter is responsible for this. As her father, I have to do something. More and more are coming. Siala. Hold on one second. How old is Sukiyomi? Why does he already have a daughter? Can somebody tell me that? How old is Sukiyomi and why does he have a daughter? And why is his daughter almost about to... His daughter looks older than Sukiyomi and that's his... What's going on? I'm 18 years old. And I don't even have a kid yet. Well, granted, that's normal, but you know what I'm trying to get at. What? Okay. Uh, we have to bring Sukuyomi for this one because obviously, you know, he has to teach his father. Well, I say his father. His father has to teach him a lesson. So there he is. Okay. We are going to bring Orochi, Felicia, Ryuma, Rinka, Nishiki, Yuhiri, Hinoka, Takumi, Crimson, Aqua, Saizo. And we will go for the last unit. I'm thinking Kagero or Cyrus. I'm gonna go Cyrus. Let's start the battle. Here goes nothing. There's a lot of faceless. Turn the poison swamp into planes. Seems like a job for Hinoka to be honest with you. Here goes nothing. Because if you wait on the poisonous swamps, you end up taking damage, I believe. Alright, so Rinka. That's not very good. That's not very good. Okay. There's a lot of faceless. Oh my god, there's a lot of faceless. They're, they're more in her area though, but... Oh, here goes nothing. Okay. Let's do this. Sorry to worry you, but you're gonna die. Whether you like it or you don't. Okay. They have a lot of HP. Oh my god. Sukiyomi, what is your daughter on? Why is she doing this? Alright, I'm gonna kill you. Because we need to get rid of all these faces. If we get rid of all the faceless in the turn that, that we're in, then they're not gonna be able to counterattack, which is gonna make my life a lot more easy. Okay, but they're living. Okay, how about Renka? You come here and then you attack. I can kill, but I'd rather go... Takumi with Cyrus on the attack. It seems promising and the critical hit chance is really high. And if I know Takumi, there it is. But he's gonna live with one HP, isn't he? Nope. Okay. So that's one down. I'm going to sing to Takumi, let him go again. Because these faceless are proving to be some real trouble, man. Alright, there it is. Hey, faceless, guess what? Wait for it. Goodbye. Wait, he's going to live with 1 HP now, isn't he? Oh no, I guess it doesn't apply to critical hits. Because this guy did it. I don't like that guy. 
I'm thinking I go with Tsukiyomi and then I come from here and I use the Alex God to take him out. And if it misses, then I have Nishiki as backup. There it is. Okay. That's a lot of experience. I usually don't take Sugiyomi around. So that's probably why he's getting a lot. Because everybody else is practically maxed out. Alright, Yugiri, this one's all you. With the silver Yumi. Here goes nothing with the breaking sky. Yeah, good luck. What is going on? I have no idea, but you know what? I'll take what I can get. And with that being said, everybody move forward. Which way should I go? Which way? How should I go about doing this? I want to go up this way. No, I'm going to go this way. I'm going to go that way. It feels the most safe in my personal opinion. But those guys can stand on the poison swamp. Oh, that's the poison swamp you're standing on, size. So I don't know if you want that. Alright, there we go. Rinka, you come all the way down here as well. Orochi, you go there. Alright. Yeah, Faceless, move closer. I'm gonna kill all of you. Uh, scratch that. That's a lot of Faceless. Alright, Hinoka. I'm gonna Dragon Vein here, but that's a lot of Faceless that you have to deal with. Okay, how much can attack you? One. Only one. Wait. Okay, only two. So two will be able to attack you. That's not the worst thing in the world. And then we could get units to stand there. That's not the worst. So, let's do it. Okay, and then from there, we'll get Rinka to be right there. And then I don't trust Cyrus to be completely honest with you. Oh look, there's more Faceless over here. But I don't know which route I want to go. I can easily send Ryuma up there and just like let him do everything. I'm going to send Ryuma right here. If they want to attack Ryuma then by all means. If they want to attack... Uh, I don't know how I feel about Rasuli getting attacked. But you know what, damn it. And I'm going to do it and then... Nobody's going to be able to reach Aqua from the current place that she's standing, so I'm going to sing to Rasuli in order for him to attack. Well, he's not going to be able to attack the Faceless, but in order for him to be close to Ryuma. Get that going for them, and also I'll put Nishiki here as well. I'll put Nishiki right here, so now they have three options of who they want to attack. Takumi is a solid option to send there. Yugiri, I feel the same thing as well. Uh, let's give them... We'll give them Orochi. And then everyone else will come this way. That's, that's a couple of strong units right there. I might give them Crimson later, but either way, they're going to meet up in the center. So I'm going to rally there. And then Sukiyomi, you go here. And I will put you right there. Cyrus, I can actually attack with. But yeah, I don't, it doesn't look like I'm going to want to do that. It doesn't. So I'm going to end the turn here and see how this plays out. Everybody wants to attack Yudoka. No big deal though because they don't do much damage and I'm getting free damage off on them. Granted, it's not much, but it's something. You do a lot, but you missed because you're a pussy. Attacking Nishiki, you're gonna miss because you're, you know. Yeah, there it is. And I'm gonna kill you, it's what it looks like. And goodbye, Faceless. Now begs the question, are you going to attack Ryuma? Attacking Rinka is an interesting choice. Simply based on the fact that you actually got no damage off on her. Now everybody's coming really close. These individuals are easy to handle though. I'm going to go kill her axe. This is practically a confirmed critical hit. Wait for it. There it is. Okay, it was 38%, but 
Usually when it's 38% when it comes to characters like Takumi, Ryuma, Crimson, Rasuli, then it's practically almost 100% confirmed. Now, I feel like a solid option. A solid option is to attack with anybody, to be honest with you. But I'd rather go here and go with Renka. The critical hit chance is still fairly high. There it is. All right. And the second one. Faceless are nothing. They're nothing for me. They really are. I'm, I still can't wrap my head around. I can't wrap my head around Sukiyomi having a daughter. Of course. Can you... Oh, oh. Can you wrap your head around that? Oh, do me a favor, do me a favor. Right now, sit and think about it. While while I make the rest of the units attack here. Sit and think about it. Alright? Did I give you enough time? Yeah, that's freaking crazy. Okay, maybe I didn't give you enough time to think about it, but trust me, you know that that's freaking crazy. Takumi? Yeah, there it is. That's my big brother for ya. Did I say big brother? I meant little brother. Okay. I'm just so confused about the big and little, you know, comparison now because by big and little I mean old and young. Because I don't get it anymore. I just don't. Sukuyomi has a daughter. How old is he? Damn. Maybe I'm just a little jealous. Maybe I am, because from what it looks like, from what it looks like, Sukiyomi's more sexually active than myself. That's actually kind of crazy. Okay, maybe it's not crazy, but it's pretty crazy. And as for you, I'm going to do this. And damn it, this is a critical hit if I don't ever know one. There it is. Goodbye. Wait for it. There it is. So, Orochi can actually come close. I don't know if she can take a hit, though, but I'm going to rally, damn it. Aqua can actually sing to Ryuma, which is going to let him move again. Which is going to let me kill yet another. You guessed it, Faceless. I'm thinking it's going to be this one. Hey, guess what? You ever heard of a critical hit? Because there it is. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Everybody's just like, all right. Everybody's surprised that Sukiyomi has a daughter. So they're just bringing out everything because anything is possible, right? So, you know, critical hits all over the place is possible. I'm going to pair up Rasuli and Sukiyomi. And you'll see why later. He has a 100% chance for one damage. Be scared, guys. Seriously, Takumi? I appreciate it, though. Uh, Hinoka? I appreciate that, too. You know what? There it is. Okay. Here goes nothing. You do no damage. Why do you still attack Rinka? Begs the quest. Before I can even finish my sentence, everybody's getting critical hits. Alright. Of course. Of course. Faceless. Faceless don't stand a chance, to be honest with you. Before? Way back then? They stood somewhat of a chance, but now? It's a different ball game. It really is. I, I can't, I can't say much. I can't say much, to be honest with you. Here, let's go. Let's get closer to this girl. How far can you run? You can go right to where R Ryuma is. Which is all I need, to be honest with you. Because I'm going to go like this, and then I'm going to drag in vain because, you know... The swamp is gonna make my life a lot more difficult. Well, the poisonous swamp, I should be more clear. Okay, and there it is. I will drag in vain. 
Is she willing to move though? Is Ciela, 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 is Ciela willing to move? Ciela, okay. Now I'll put you here. She's not willing to move, by the way. I don't know if you guys were aware. Nishiki being right there is a good decision, and okay, there's that. I should have rallied, but you know what? Damn it. Okay. Our hit chance isn't that high. Yeah, there it is. It wasn't that high, but they get no damage off on me. Okay, this is basically confirmed death for you, so good luck. Your friend ran away to some friend he is. You summoned some some pretty bad faceless to be honest with you. Why was I thinking that that faceless was gonna help me beat up this faceless when I used to Kumi? That's not the case. All right, there we go. Let's see what I can do. Guess what? Critical hit. It says 38% chance, but I'm starting to think that 38 is the new 100. Okay. I'm gonna come like this. Now, how about I come like this and then I'll have Crimson on my side to attack. I'd rather attack this guy, to be honest with you. Hey guys, guess what? Critical hit. Boom! That's one out the way. Uh, I say one, but we literally killed like so many to the point where it's actually it's actually kind of crazy. It's kind of crazy. All right, there is another faceless down. I think there's only one more left. To be honest with you, it might be two. Yeah, there's two. But you know what? That's perfectly fine. I'm gonna go ahead and end this turn off. Attacking Takumi is actually a great decision because he can't attack you, but you can't hurt him, so I don't know. I don't know what you think. Attacking Yugiri is also a good decision. I have a feeling you're gonna land this one. Psych, okay. No, seriously though, guys. This is actually kind of crazy. I'm gonna go right here. And then, because I want. Okay, so I'm gonna go here as well. No. Okay, you can come right here. Alright. With the power of the Fujin Bow. Okay, there it is. And now, uh, Hinoka should be able to kill because we have Takumi's side. So here goes nothing. Alright. I was counting on that critical hit because we wouldn't have been able to kill without it. So, it's appreciated, Takumi. It really is. Now, there's only one more faceless left here. Uh, let's let Rinka deal with it. Let's let Rinka deal with it. Well, obviously we're using Yugiri now, but I meant after this. Hold on. Just give me a second. Or maybe not because we have Breaking Sky, but that's not going to be... Yeah, that's not going to be enough. Actually, let's let Saizo because... No, not Saizo. Uh, Cyrus? Cyrus? Uh, you're not doing so well. Oh, that's too risky. You know what? I'm going to do it just because... Yeah. Yeah, that's not good. That is not good, but I said, I said, you know what? Rinka is going to finish it off. Rinka is going to make everything okay. And if she doesn't, then sucks for me. Of course she does. Goodbye, Faceless. All right, with that being said, there are no more Faceless. So basically what I'm going to do here is I'm going to wait this out and then... Here, Ryuma, this is all you, buddy. No, but you're gonna kill her. I don't want you to kill her. Here, Orochi, will Orochi kill her? I don't know. I don't want you to kill her because I want Sukiyomi to get the final hit. Of course, more faceless come. I thought it was, hold on. Okay, I'm gonna do Tiger God. <laughs> kind of a creepy laugh there maybe I made it creepy but okay okay that was a good joke that was a good joke sweetheart you tried oh this is like a now or never situation but I think if I come here I have a better option yeah okay no don't don't use Rasuli that's too easy oh it's time to talk you came dad look look the forbidden spell of summoning was successful see more and more are coming one after another Stop it, you fool, with this, even if we defeat some, they're endless. Huh? But I'm not satisfied. 
Listen, clean all this up right now. You can clean your own mess. What? Clean my own mess? Siala. Fine, I'll clean up. That's it? Oh, so now she's on our team. I was gonna kill her, to be honest with you guys. I was oh mad I was gonna kill her. But you guys already know this. You guys know that I was... Yeah, you guys... Yeah, come here. Come here. Yeah, that's right. You guys come to me. Alright. I can let you guys come closer, but you know what? Forget that. Forget that. It's not worth it. Alright, watch that dodge, and there it is. Now, I'm gonna come like this. Yeah, they literally can't do any damage to... Rinka. It's crazy. It is crazy. Yeah, you know what? I'm thinking I'm just gonna end this turn and just let Ryuma get like a cleanup, but you know what? We can't do that. We can't do that. Well, actually, we can do that if, if we really wanted to. Do we really want to do that? All right, how about this? Okay. All right, how about this? We'll bank it on a critical hit, okay? So the way I'm going to do this is... Yeah, I know Hinoka needs some experience in order to get to max, but don't worry about that. If Takumi gets a critical hit, we will let... We'll end the turn right now and let Ryuma clean up. If he doesn't, then we're not going to end the turn. We're going to use everybody else, okay? All right, let's do it. Here goes nothing. Of course, there it is. I secretly wanted Ryuma to clean up, which is why I did that, which is why I made that deal, because I knew he was going to be able to do it. I knew he was going to bring it out. So, Takumi's going to get damage here. That's not good. Okay. Oh, you guys messed with the wrong one. Okay. What weapon does Sukiyomi's daughter use? She uses a Ox God. Hmm. Gee, I wonder. Sometimes I wonder. Alright, watch out. Okay. Now, the thing that I wondered about is I wanted to do that so we can get Ryuma on the attack. Hey guys, guess what? Wait for it. No, that wasn't what I was waiting for. Okay, let me show you guys what I was waiting for. Hey guys, guess what? That's not what I was waiting for either. Where are my critical hits? I don't need them. I don't need them, but they would be nice here. I can always count on Crimson for a good old critical hit. Crimson, please. There it is. That's the ending I wanted to this paralogue. Goodbye. I clean up your mess, Siala. Siala? There we go. Looks like it's all cleaned up. If you're going to continue, study something better. Better studies, hmm? How about a spell to make someone taller or cure a case of baby face? What? You also study something like that? So that's your preference. Anyway, she's insulting your father. I'm banning you from study and using forbidden spells, got it? I hate that. Honestly, even if you say that, I won't lift the ban. However, I do have a condition. You can stay with us from now on. What? You're saying that I have to leave the nice and cozy secluded region where I can be alone and do what I want? Yep, if I leave you alone, I won't know what you're getting yourself into. So your studies will be limited to what I approve. It can't be helped. I'll do just that. I got it. I acknowledge your instructions. Alright, then let's talk about your next studies immediately. A spell to make someone taller and cure their baby face. How's that for a full-fledged research topic? <laughs> hey now, it's okay if I also request an area of study. A spell to make it so someone could finally be able to go out alone at night. And a spell so someone won't cry after they make a blunder in their magic. That sort of thing would be good. Will you consider it? Who needs those kind of spells? It's for your father. I think that stuff should be cured before his height or baby face. Stop talking! Okay, I'll keep it in mind. Dad has unexpected troubles. It'll be fun to solve them. Everyone, please treat me well. We will. We will. It's time to say goodbye to this place. I'm not the sentimental type, but it does feel a bit sad. Huh? No, is that- Oh no, one of them survived! 
Hold it, faceless. Phew, that was a close call. Are you alright, Siala? Oh. What's wrong? Are you hurt? What's your name? Um, me? Well, I'm Rasuli. Rasuli, yes, your name is Rasuli. That's a wonderful name. Thank you. I'll remember it for the rest of my life. Thank you for saving me, Rasuli. I owe you my life. Ah, that's the first time anyone's been so nice to me. I'll follow you forever. Um, whether you're sleeping, awake, or in combat, I'll never take my eyes off you for even a moment. I'm glad we met, Rasuli. Ah, that name never tastes any less sweet, no matter how many times I say it. She's gone. What was that all about? I don't really get it, but was she thanking me? That Sial is quite a mystery girl. You called Rasuli? Whoa! I'm right here, always. I'll always be right behind you. Ah. Uh, looks like I have a, um. Oh, what should I call that? I have absolutely no idea. She seems like a sweet girl, though. I actually like her a lot, to be completely honest with you guys. But anyways, that is basically it for this paralogue, guys. Please remember to comment, like, and subscribe to Rasuli Plays. It really does help out a lot. Follow all of my social media links in the video description. If you have a question or a suggestion for a series, let me know in the comment box below. If I have a personal message or on my social media. But other than that, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will catch you guys tomorrow for some more Fire Emblem Fates for the Nintendo 3DS. So I will see you guys then. Later.